Hi and hello everybody. Welcome to Sits Classroom. Today in this video tutorial, I am going to show you as to how you can use Google Maps offline for navigation in your places. So to get started, you need to download the uh, Google Maps of the area of your particular interest. For this, you need to have your Wi-Fi turned on. If you can see here, I have uh, got my Wi-Fi turned on here. Okay, so now let me just go to Google Maps. I'll search for one particular place. Say Chennai Tamil Nadu. It appears here. Just click on that. It will take you to the map of Chennai Tamil Nadu here. So as soon as this gets here, all you need to do is swipe this region up when you swipe this you you get some uh, more information about uh, chennai tamil nadu or the map of here and here you can see three dots here click on the dot and choose download offline area actually what happens here is you get a square box if you can see outlined in blue you can move your map around Uh, so that it covers all your uh, area of interest here and then just give download I have already downloaded this map so I'll just close you need to have uh, for navigation sake offline you need to have your uh, GPS turned on now let me just turn off my Wi-Fi my Wi-Fi is turned off so let me go to my present location so my GPS is turned on so it gives me my uh, current location if you can see here and then I'll add my area of choose destination so currently I am in uh, say Bangalore Karnataka so I'll choose one area within Bangalore. So let me choose a popular place, the railway station. Bangalore uh, or perhaps the airport that is the one appearing much faster so I'll choose the Bangalore airport here international airport click on that so it will give you a route so it will give you a route here and if you choose this navigation button it will guide you turn by turn um, right onto second cross road, then turn left onto eight main road. Okay, fine. So the one major disadvantage, and let me just put forward before things happen, is that uh, you don't get the live traffic view. And just in case you switch uh, roads, your map doesn't get updated. That is one uh, basic disadvantage of this. Another way to travel uh, between uh, two locations with your offline map is uh, just uh, go here. and before you type your destination you have a choice called choose on map click on that you get to move around you get to move around and uh, drop the pin here to drop the pin just click ok here it says how long it is and again you can take the turn by turn navigation turn right onto second cross road then turn left onto 8 main road head east on so that is how it is you can use google maps offline for turn by turn navigation within the place you are in say the main uh, uh, disadvantage is this uh, it doesn't uh, link what to say between two maps 
say if you want uh, to cross between two states this is a big problem in this for that uh, you need to have a, an intersection of two states or whatever downloaded that is a bit tricky so you can use this maps for an uh, intracity navigation that's it folks i hope it was useful thanks for watching take care bye bye